The exchange of baton happened at the police headquarters, Yola, Adamawa State, as the outgoing commissioner of police, CP Babatola Adeniyi, hands over to the new commissioner of police, CP Maurice Dankobo. Ah, uh, we are we are here gathered today. Have confidence in the Nigeria Police Force, in general and Adamawa in particular. And the second prayer was that God should give me that grace that if I'm leaving this seat, I should live to a higher capacity. And to the glory of God, and to the benefit of mankind, the two prayers were granted to me by God. As of today, Adama happens to be one of the best secured states in the Federation. As of today, I'm living as an Assistant Inspector General of Police. <laughs> and coincidentally, I've been moved to Zone 3, which comprises both Adamawa and Taraba State. <laughs> so you can see that God has been so gracious to me. Let me sincerely use this opportunity to thank each and every members of the police force in Adamawa State Police Command, from the then DC Ops, now the person who is taking over the reign from me, <laughs> to the last constable in the command, for your dedication, loyalty, and commitment to the job. It is due to the collaborative effort that we are able to achieve whatever we achieved as members of the Nigeria Police Force. And that is the peace we are enjoying today. And let me also use this opportunity to thank the number one citizen of Odamawa State in the person of Right Honorable Amadou Marufintri, CON, the governor of the state, and members of the populace for their cooperation. Believe me sincerely, when we, when we go for meetings, we meet, we used to rub minds together, we interface with other colleagues. I used to hear their stories. But believe me sincerely, for the good one year I was here as commissioner of police, the governor never for one day gave me any instruction as far as my job is concerned. And no matter the problem I took to him, he solved it, one, as a governor, and two, as a father. On this, I immensely owe him lot of gratitude for allowing me to do my job as a professional police officer. <laughs> Leaving behind coherent, loyal, and dedicated officers. To be candid, I never have any reservation about anybody. Everybody did their job as is expected. So, you don't have anything to fear about. Thank God you are in the familiar terrain. So, I wish you God's guidance, God's grace, and God's wisdom Amen. that will make you to pilot the 
affairs of Adama State Police Command. Today, I'm proud, and I will repeat, I'm proud to have served as Commissioner of Police, Adama State Police Command. Commanders and HOGs present here, the divisional managers, senior police officers, the chairman PCRC, stakeholders present here, religious leaders and traditional rulers, members of the press, distinguished ladies and gentlemen. First and foremost, let me begin to give honor to whom honor is due, to the almighty God for his care and protections upon our life and for the golden opportunity he has given to me to assume office today as the 32nd Commissioner of Police at the Mount State uh, Command. I equally want to seize this opportunity to thank the Inspector General of Police, IGP Kayode Olu, Olu, Ade Olu, PHG NMM, for finding me worthy and posting me to Adam Asset Command as the 32nd Commissioner of Police. Indeed, today's handing and taking over between my humble self and my boss, the AIG, is historic. Historic in the sense that a boss is now handing over to one of his subordinates whom he has groomed while piloting the affairs of this uh, state. <laughs> Sir, I lack a word to express my gratitude and appreciation. It is my sincere prayer that Wherever you go, the almighty God will continue to guide you, will continue to protect you in your new office. Amen. Now, my action plan for the command is that of, my action plan is going to be in line with the mission and vision of the Inspector General of Police. And this includes to deal firmly with all acts of criminalities, ranging from kidnapping, menace of Sheila boys, cattle wrestling, armed robbery, and other form of anti-social disorder. To build and to enhance and to sustain all proactive measures in place by my predecessor in which I happen to be a critical stakeholder. Much emphasis will be placed on community policing and community engagement of stakeholders. This will be done in tandem with international best practices and having due respect for people's fundamental human rights. Corruption and extortion under my watch, and whatsoever guys will not be condoned from any personnel, as complaint decks is already put in place to address all forms of complaint. Community policing, as part of my operational plans, community policing will be reinforced in the fight against crime and criminality. And to assure the good people of Adamawa State that I will ensure that the template or the tempo he has used in achieving this feat will be maintained, will be sustained and be maintained. And I want to assure you that I will redouble my effort to ensure that the people of this state go to bed and sleep with their two eyes closed.
Finally, I want to urge the good people of Adamawa State to have due respect, to observe due respect to the rule of law. And I solicit for your maximum support and cooperation to providing us with credible information. You may agree with me that security is a collective responsibility. You see something and say something. So I want to plead to the members of the public to provide us with useful information. I'm handing over to you the reins of commandership of the General State Police Command so that it is to, to pretend over and above all the officers and men. Please take note that the most paramount thing in the command is peace and security. On this note, I hand over to you the document that will guide you Okay. 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 Sound of warning. All your loyalties, all your loyalties to me as Commissioner of Police, Adama State Police Command, ceased a few minutes ago. All your 100% loyalty should now be directed to the new commissioner of police. The handing and taking over was successful as officers and men of the police force were all excited to receive their new CP. I am Ojama Yusuf, 